Hey YouTube, it's chatting with you, I'm back with another video. So the energy that I was feeling is that somebody could be getting blackmailed or could be about to blackmail, trying to blackmail you for something. Okay, I feel like it's something with a court or a legal situation and see, things is not going in their favor. So they could want to like blackmail you um, into helping them get through something, get through this legal issue or something like that. Um, but yeah, everything gonna work out. See, this person think that holding something over your head or, you know, putting you in a, in a, in feeling like they could put you in a position to where you don't have no choice. But see, yeah, it's somebody from you. Putting you in a position to feel like you don't have no choice but to do this. And let me tell you something. Things is going to be made right uh, behind this person doing this. Because see, this person don't have no good intentions behind what they doing anyway. And to, to blackmail somebody, period, and make them feel like... It, like just to blackmail somebody period is wrong as fuck okay but when you already fucking wrong and you just trying to cover your tracks so that's the only reason why you blackmailing them you dead ass wrong for that okay so i don't know if you watching or you know the one who's blackmailing um but you wrong as fuck and if you're being blackmailed shit gonna be made right for you because see this person that's doing this to you they only doing this to cover their ass or to try to cover their ass but see was right is right and was wrong is wrong and things is gonna be made clear people be so like how you getting yourself caught up it's like this person is willing to drag anybody down with them by any means necessary they don't give a fuck who go down with them at this point because see they know they life is up shit's creep okay so it's just like whoever they could take down with them on the way down they ain't got a problem with grabbing your ass that's so fucked up. What is this energy? Yo, you got the five of cups. Yeah, see, somebody is heartbroken. But it's like they they broke their own heart doing the shit that they did. Now they want to be sad and in regret because, see, now all their cups is spilling over. Yeah. I'm telling you, somebody is about to be caught up in some shit. Either really locked up. Or they, they, they already in the midst of conflict now. They might really be getting arrested. And this is why they trying to drag somebody down right along with they ass. Y'all. Like, <laughs> I'm telling you somebody whole fucking life is like full. It's like going downhill one by one by one. Everything is just falling the fuck apart. But see, they don't even realize this is the shit that they called on themselves. Whether they was trying to have your life fall apart or try to keep you in this five of cups, eight of swords energy. But see, it's like now, I'm telling you, it's like this person is like grabbing. Like, I'm seeing like they willing to pull anybody down with them on their way right down to the bottom. You got this knight of cups coming out. What's this knight of cups energy? This could be somebody who trying to come and bring a cup of, uh, offer to you. You know? Like, they could have tried to keep you. They, they could have had you. Let me get more. Because, all right, you got the Knight of Wands. A lot of night, two night, night energy out here. I'm getting, like, somebody is a, like, an asshole. Somebody is a complete asshole. You got the Justice. The strength, the five of swords, and the two of cups. And that's crazy because you got the emperor at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so now what I'm getting is somebody could have wanted to have you stuck in your head about a situation. You know what I'm saying? But see, I feel like now this person is stuck and this person want to come in and offer like a cup of love to you. It don't have to be um, relationship-wise. It could be platonic. But see, it's like somebody want to come in 
make a nice gesture to you but i feel like that's because they know what's coming for them see it's like just with this justice card here shit is balancing out and i feel like this person could either be trying to blackmail you or they could be trying to come in like butter you up get on your soft side get on your sweet side because see they know that shit is crumbling behind the scenes for them could be a libra or um, a, a leo with this um with the justice and the strength card here it doesn't have to be but see it's like i'm also getting that somebody no, it's like the, somebody is in their head also because they know like justice is coming for you see this if this was a relationship where somebody tried to keep you stuck in your head and all of that shit they know that you got something new something genuine coming your way and this shit got them trapped in their head it's like this person could have tried to keep you stuck but you put it into that shit you like nah I'm telling you, it's like the scales is balancing out on all levels. Look. Somebody you just... Somebody tried to, like, break your heart or keep you... But see, with this three of swords, seven of swords, that's a ten of swords. That's just, this shit is coming to an end. A complete end, and they heartbroken. It's like all that seven of swords, all this lying, manipulation, and all that that they, they, they tried to do. It only broke their heart. It, it only left them broken. Because they know this shit is over with. Like, I'm hearing game over. All the games they tried to play. The mind games. The manipulations. Like, all that shit is over. It's no more of that. I feel like you healed yourself from that shit. The one thing for sure, two things for certain. They cannot touch you. They can't touch you. Well, I cannot make it up. You got the seven of cups here with the emperor again. It's like this person that they don't necessarily they could be an aries leo sagittarius and you already got the leo call here but see this person could have been in this like tricky energy trying to you know manipulate a situation but it's like they can't no more it's like i feel like everybody see who the fuck they are maybe you don't see it and they feel like they still got a chance to um come in and try to you know fuck some shit up look but see this you i can't fucking make it up look empress nine of cups nine of pentacles eight of cups it's like you left that shit right the fuck behind like this is your energy collective this 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 is that other energy that's outside of you this is your energy you know what i'm saying you 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 having peace and happiness right now all these people that wanted you in this man listen man listen it could even be family it could be family let's see you ain't playing with these motherfuckers with this queen of swords you ain't playing with them you ain't playing with them well this could be somebody you had a family with however it go it's like you standing in your power you doing what it is you got to do but see somebody's life is crumbling this could be past energy too when somebody could have tried to um blackmail you or try to stop you from doing what it is that you was doing but you still said fuck it and went on ahead and and, and living your best life okay these part this people or this person is stubborn as fuck it really could be a masculine this person is stubborn as fuck I'm getting also it could be multiple people. What is this? Look. <laughs> the grass is fake and altercation. It's like you realizing just how fake and fuck like fucked up these people are. Somebody could really want to fight you because you don't allow them in your energy. You don't allow them in your space no more. It's like I feel like you really saying fuck you. <laughs> that's it period like i ain't dealing with you like i'm here i ain't trying to kick it with you skate with you none of that somebody could be from atlanta could live in atlanta about to move to atlanta yeah with this new view 
I feel like, see, I feel like you really had the strength to overcome a lot of shit. A lot of shit. And it's like, you may be surprised by the, the strength you had to overcome this shit. I'm getting somebody put a move to a new city or state behind this shit. Like, just trying to get the fuck away from people. Like, nah, this situation is too much. I gotta go. Yeah, you have romantic thoughts and therapists. It could be somebody who you was in a relationship with. Or somebody who is like, this person is um going crazy about you. I'm here, I'm going crazy, 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 just thinking about you lately. Crazy, 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 just thinking. I'm also getting that this could be the person who left you, the person they're with now could be blackmailing them, okay? Or trying to, like, y'all got to take it where it resonates. Somebody is definitely being blackmailed. Somebody is wanting to bring like i'm telling you if this person on this past person is being blackmailed is like this person that they're with that's blackmailing them could be trying to hold like i said hold something over their head but i feel like this person is like they what you call like when you do just enough to keep somebody like this is what this person this, do, this person is doing the bare minimum so that this person this other person doesn't see what the fuck they're doing like it's like the minute this person think they about to up and leave all hell gonna break loose all hell gonna break loose yeah you got a fork in the road it's like somebody is is trying to make a decision it's like do i leave in um you know let this person expose me or say whatever it is that they holding over my head or do i just hold it down but i feel like either way this this person karma for going through that but you still don't do that to nobody you still don't like you still don't hold something over their head or blackmail them like oh if you leave me or this and that i'm gonna i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that like but you got caution yeah this motherfucker is like it's like this person could be moving with a lot of caution like they so cool they it's like they walking on eggshells with this person right now they scared they don't want this person to 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 reveal their dirty secrets whatever that may have been you got phased in the wrong way but see i feel like this person knew that they went the wrong way now and they just waiting for this phase to end they could really be um trying to work with the moon to get about this situation like they praying to god like god please release me from this shit like this person like they feel like they would never ever ever make that that mistake again if they got another chance Yeah, it's like they come into their breaking point. This shit is too much. This person cries a lot. This person, I, I mean, like a grown ass person, they really cry themselves to sleep at night because it's becoming a burden. It's becoming a burden. Like living this lie or living this illusion that, and they not okay. They are not okay. I'm telling you, this person could be saying, this person could know that they did something that could land them in jail. And they like, if you leave me, I'm telling the cops. Like, they got evidence. Like, whatever it is, this person has the evidence that's needed to really put this person away and see, or, or something like that. And this person is like, they scared. But it's becoming too much for them. You got angel numbers out here. This person could really, like... Like, this person could be seeing a lot of angel numbers. But see, this whoever's doing this um, manipulation shit or the blackmailing, this person think this shit funny. It's like they feel like they got this person, this other person's world in the palm of their hand right now. But see, they gonna get karma for that shit too. You don't do that. You not God. You know what I'm saying? I feel like things are gonna be exposed. People get exposed in divine time and when shit's supposed to come out you don't that's not your place to hold something over somebody's head or feel like you know you don't do that you don't do that that's what you don't do you got cash flow christmas and leveling up i 
I feel like I feel like that's you collective. I'm also getting that this person, yeah, because you got clean codependency and kicked out coming out. Like it's like this person may be like this person could even live with them. And this person could this, like I'm a, like y'all gotta take it where it resonates. Somebody could be living with somebody, right? And the person who house it is, like say, Mike is living with Tina. Tina is blackmailing Mike right now, okay? And he could want to put her out or whatever the fuck. <laughs> but she's so codependent on him. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> she's so codependent on him that she's threatening this man in his own place. Like, if you put me out, I'm going to tell. Or I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. Okay? Like, I feel like Mike could be obsessed with True Collective. Meanwhile, you leveling up. You getting all these gifts. Um, your, your, your cash is right behind the scenes. This is what's going on in this person's life, or it could be Mike Black and Tina. Who knows? Take it where it resonates. But see, somebody is definitely living with somebody, and it's like this person can't get out, like they won't leave, they blackmailing them, they watching their every move, they watching every, your every move. Because, see, they know that this person, you are where this person really want to be. Regardless if you want to take them back or not, this person just feels like, you know what? I have control of this situation. I'm not letting this person go nowhere. I don't care what the situation is. You don't do no shit like that. Let's get more on this. What's this about? Three of Swords, Six of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups. And we had the Two of Cups out here and the Three of Swords. Yeah. I'm telling you, it's like somebody somebody ain't got shit. And that's why they feel like, like they need this person. Like they letting this person just do whatever to them. Because, okay, Tina could have the money or Mike could have the money. It's like whoever got the money, they know like this person ain't got shit. So it's like, oh, you need me. You know what I'm saying? That's how this person feel. But see, they, it's like they, they holding this shit over their head. Like whatever it is, they going to act like they always offering them a cup of love. Like they there for them. Like, like they, they, they act like they, they help them financially. But see, they want this person on their knees, always begging, always like this before this person give this person money and say, here go start you a business or go you know get 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 your shit your paperwork in order so you could get a job this person want them to be codependent on them this person want them to always ask always need always oh like it's like this person needs to be felt like they they are needed page of cups in the reverse there's no real love there there ain't no real love there. But I see, like, I feel like this person is getting to their breaking point where they just, like, you know what? In a little while, they're going to be like, fuck it. Say what you got to say or do what you got to do because it's becoming too much for them. Got the four of pentacles. I feel like this person is holding back. Like, they are even hold Like, whatever money they do have, they penny pension. Because, see, I'm hearing that they trying to make a great escape. Like, they might not have a lot, but they got enough. And they trying to get the fuck away from this person. Because this person is... This this energy is nasty. Like, it's just a nasty-ass energy. A dark-ass energy. Yeah, you got the star. I feel like this... Like, whoever this is that's being blackmailed like they 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 know who they are you know what i'm saying they know who they are it's like they know the power they possess they just they feel like they feel like they can't do nothing right now I'm telling you they feel like they can't do nothing you got the queen of cups in the um world see collective you I feel like this you like 
somebody who's I can't make it up. Somebody who is very intuitive. Very intuitive. It's like you could have seen this shit coming from a mile away. Like, you know, you could have even warned this. Look, with the emperor right here, you could have even warned him. And this person just thought they knew what they was doing. And this nine of cups probably trying to hold back from you and like made it seem like you was no you knew what the fuck you was talking about but see that's what i'm saying everything happened for a reason look they got the nine of cups and in, in the in, in a and the nine of pentacles it's like this person held back from you did all this to you you know for whatever fucking reason but see that shit done flipped on them It's like you could have warned this person, like, don't do that. Don't get with this person or this is what's going to happen. And see, they thought that you was being bitter or that you was hating on them or... No, you just knew. You with this, you knew what the fuck was going on. You may not have even knew the person that they was with, but the energy. It's like you felt the energy. You was like, uh-uh, something ain't right. Something ain't right. Now this person done got themselves caught up in some shit and they like... Bro, what the fuck is going on? I'm telling you, this person do a whole lot of crying because it's like it's too much. It's too heavy. And the fact that you you tried to warn them about the shit and they didn't listen. Yeah, they ain't listen. They wanted to be this knight of wands. Fiery and ah, ah, ah with the knight and the four wands. They could have tried to put you in competition with this person. Put you in some... Like, you know, like you had to compete or battle. Done fuck they whole stability up. They whole shit. Somebody whole living situation, they whole dynamic is like at, up, at, at the shit. But see, you, you put it into that shit. You like, I ain't getting in no fucking competition with no has-been ass bitch. I ain't doing that. You, I'm going to leave you the fuck alone. You go handle that. And now it's like that, that, that shit done coming to an end. It's like you can't come back here with this with this queen of swords. You like because I told your ass. I told you what the fuck was gonna happen. You ain't wanna listen. Look, you thought you was it was gonna be a happy family, this and that, this and that. This person really left something that could have been could have been with this ten of pentacles. I said ten of pentacles. Look. They left some shit that was real. And that, what I'm saying is the fucking truth. And it's like you getting all this balance in your life. And now this person is fucking crying. Crying in the river. I'm hearing, cry me a river. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Now they see it. Now it's like, oh, now shit want to click. But when I was telling you, you didn't want to hear it because it was coming from me. Like, like this is somebody who, like, they would know what the fuck you saying is true. But because... It's you who's saying it. They don't want to hear it. But those who don't hear must feel. <laughs> those who don't hear must feel. And baby, he is feeling this shit. He is feeling this shit. Yeah, honestly, I can't accept. I can't always accept the truth from others, but I can always accept it from myself. It's like you was being honest with this person. You wasn't you wasn't being um shady about the shit. You was when you was Giving this person your true opinion, your true advice on something, they thought that because you were the ex or whatever, whatever. And it's like, I don't give a fuck if you with me or not, but I'm telling you what is about to happen before the shit happened and you ain't listening. You know what I'm saying? It's like now this, this person with this blame and doubt here is like, they like this person, like, cause see, shit could have been rocky with them in the beginning, like from jump. But they blamed you like you're the reason that shit is happening and this is why. No, the shit was destined to happen that way any fucking way. It's like this person wanted, they didn't want to see shit for what it was. They didn't want to see shit for what it was, but now all they want is peace. And all they get is fucking drama. So, that's just how the fucking cookie crumble. So, this is the reading until next time.